Teraré, Saite, mi cerebro, su nuchira, Sarere, Baca, Baca. Anta no cami te lo, solo ho dos goy onda ni amena. Dona, Honto ni Anta ya tano. Shabeli ga sugiru yo. Kanashi to akiramete, naki o mi cerebro. Japanese cinema had that thing of it felt like there was um, no boundaries really. There was that, that element of that, that, like that recklessness, that sort of danger of how far you can push certain things. Wari to igai na no wa, watakushi yori nana nen senpai de chodo watakushi ga haitta koro kantoku debut sareta fukasa kinji kantoku. Yo kantoku oshite wa Hito Shinya san no sasori dai saku to iu no to sono saku san no Jinji no hakaba ga kono ni hon ga boku ni tote jo kantoku jidai no. They fit into this, uh, this broader idea of female revenge films uh, that's universal and that many different countries have examples of these types of films. There is actually a broad subgenre of, of female revenge. He's not an entirely, he's not a particularly well known director outside of Japan. Uh, he only made about a dozen films. <laughs> You know, there is an appeal to see strong ass kicking, tough women in cinema, and Meiko Kaji was one of the best. The, the reason that she remains in that top spot is because there's not really been anyone to rival her since. 自分ながらにあるわけですけれどもただこう余裕を逆に欠いていることでぎゅうぎゅうこう煮詰めていったところでのある種のサソリ像。Yet she will perhaps forever be remembered for her roles as Nami Matsushima, the Scorpion, and as Yuki Kashima, aka Lady Snowblood. 女の血の恨み